Hi guys, welcome back to my channel again. For today's video I will share with you how to overclock CPU on Android without root using ELF file and Termix. And to optimize your CPU for gaming, and to fix lag and to fix FPS drop, especially to boost your CPU performance for heavy games. So guys listen carefully and follow what I will do to avoid mistakes. Let's go to tips guys, first allow storage permission in your Termix, but in my Termix it doesn't have storage permission, but in other Termix it has storage permission. Next, open Termix then type apt update and apt upgrade. Then enter Y. Then type Termix Setup Storage, then enter. Then enter Y. Now I will check my CPU frequency in CPU Z, and you will see that it does not enter high frequency, and it is not stable. Now let's go, but first download the file in the comment section, then follow what I will do, to know how to extract the file. Now open the readme.txt file, then follow the instructions in the text file. Now copy the file to the Termix directory. Then grant it executable permission. Then run the file. But before I run the file I will check my CPU frequency first. You see my CPU frequency and it doesn't go to max frequency. Now I run will the file, then watch the result. Now don't close Termix then check CPU frequency. You see guys, it goes to max CPU frequency and it's stable. Now I will try to go back to default and watch the result, to go back to default or close the file, tap Ctrl plus 4. Then check the CPU frequency and it is back to default. But guys, I do not recommend you to use the CPU's overclocking file, 
because it causes overheating and lag and lowers FPS performance, but don't worry it has CPU's optimizer to optimize your CPU performance for gaming and to boost FPS performance. It's just the same process guys, just copy the file to the Termix directory, then grant it executable permission, then run the file. Here guys, enter the CPU core with strong megahertz like CPU 7 or any CPU ID with strong megahertz. To check which CPU has high megahertz just open CPU Z and you will see it on first open. In my CPU core with high megahertz is CPU 6 and CPU 7 so I choose CPU 7. Here guys, when it says failed to set CPU 7 it means, it didn't work, but just try any CPU or CPU 0. It's done guys, note, do not remove Termix in the background if you play, just remove all background app except Termix. Now you can play any heavy game without lag and smooth performance. Then guys when you're done playing the game, just quit the file in Termix, just tap Ctrl plus 4. It's done guys, thanks for watching, and don't forget to subscribe for more videos like this.